Also, we want to get back over to Dave. We have learned that Tropical Storm Barry is now Hurricane Barry. And Dave, you were telling us earlier this was a fine line between a couple of uh, degrees of wind, I believe. Yeah, uh, it was 70. Now it's up to 75, and that is the, of course, the minimum here uh, for it to be a hurricane. Does it say if it's officially landfall yet with the new advisory coming in? Uh, here, right there. Uh, a hurricane is it's moving into it's just moving into the coastline now they're saying so yeah it's uh, making landfall as we speak here at this 10 o'clock hour winds there are at 75 miles per hour so yes it is making it officially a hurricane here as the 10 o'clock update pressure down actually up a little bit 993 but the winds at 75 and here's a little good news not much it's moving one mile per hour faster than it was as uh, moving on in so uh, again 70 75 wind speeds difference is just moving into from one thing to another from tropical Tropical storm to hurricane. So we officially have Hurricane Barry as it continues to work its way in. It'll spread a lot of heavy rain. All this gradually will wrap around the system and eventually once it moves in, then we'll kind of see that expansive. Look at this. You can already start seeing it now as the rain's kind of wrapping on the back side of it, which we have yet to see until right now. So the forecast, of course, continues moving it inland here through the 130 time frame, heading up toward Alexandria by 4 a.m. Still a tropical storm at Crawley there, so just near the Lafayette area. Alexandria by say four o'clock and then heading farther to the north as we go on into tonight. Shreveport area by Sunday night and then a little rock there by Monday morning. So it will be a slow mover as it makes this track. And that's a problem because when that means we're still on the uh, uh, eastern side of this. All that suddenly flow continues and like we were talking about earlier at the desk that that just means that heavy rain continues to come in at least in the next 24 to 48 hours.